We are. We've had some heavy rain over a good chunk of the weekend. It's still ongoing right now. It's starting to push on out, though, but we are still seeing a flood watch throughout some of the area. So high temperatures yesterday climbed to 78 degrees. You can see we avoided some of that massive heat that's still built and even made its way into Iowa and Illinois as well. But our high temperatures into those mid to upper 70s, 83 being reached into Oshkosh and Sheboygan, though you were the warm spots. Now this morning, Morning. Temperatures are about 5 to 10 degrees cooler than just 24 hours ago. So a little bit of a different morning out there. Rain still ongoing into the mid to upper 60s. As you can see some heat if you headed just further south into the state, into the upper 70s being felt. Plus it's more humid and miserable as well. As you can see some dry air sitting just up to the north of us. Plus some more refreshing temperatures. As you can see in the north woods, into the mid 50s as you head out the door. Mid 60s on the lake shore, low 70s in the the Fox Valley. In fact, Fond du Lac, you're at 76 degrees this morning. It's also humid there as well. So you can see that mugginess definitely being felt throughout the Fox Valley and Southern Lakeshore areas. But the winds are starting to change. Notice they're still out of the south, right through the air, the warm areas, but up to the north. They are pulling in out of the north, which is giving us some more refreshing air behind the system. So we were in a flash flood watch still, but this has just been canceled in the Fond du Lac Sheboygan area. They keep pushing it to the south, where some of the that heavier rain is still falling. You can see a flash flood warning ongoing into northern Illinois. But here for us, things are winding down. We are on nearing the ends of this. You can still see it's raining along the shores of the bay and some heavy rain still expected over the next hour into Door County. But after that, we are going to see some relief. But keep in mind, it's soggy. It's flooding in some areas and rivers are going to keep rising as we got nearly one to four inches. Seymour, New London, even just North Appleton getting hit hard into Kiwani as well through Green Bay. So rivers keeps rising. Keep in mind, you don't want to drive through any flooded roadways. Turn around don't drown and those could still continue to rise even when the rain stops. So keep that in mind. High pressure will start to settle in later on today, but we're going to have to battle the clouds first. So rain winding down by 9 a.m. Winds pulling in out of the north, getting breezy under cloudy skies, but then the sunshine will pop out right before the day ends for a beautiful sunset. Maybe some of those clouds will be lingering, making it gorgeous, but some fog building in this morning, fog expected again tomorrow morning, and then a bunch of sunshine after that. So do keep in mind your morning commute might be delayed just a little bit once again tomorrow like it is this morning. Take it easy. So beautiful sunshine expected for us tomorrow. Comfortable temperatures, dry dew points. In fact, we really don't have a miserable muggy day ahead as we cruise throughout this week and even into the weekend. It's going to feel fantastic. Plus some drier conditions expected as we cruise through the next two weeks. Not the best story for the Northwoods. You are still abnormally dry. So thankfully you are getting this rain out there this morning. Look at that Lambo, just foggy, dreary out there. Sunset 8.08 this evening. Appleton, good morning. It's 70 degrees. We are going to rise just a few more degrees today. That's it. Temperatures into the low 70s tonight, crashing cool and clear as well into the upper 40s to mid 50s. And then tomorrow, kind of some perfect temperatures, mid to upper 70s to low 80s. A lot of sunshine. It's just going to be perfect, honestly, all week long. So if you like the heat, Wednesday is the day for you. It's the warmest day of the week into the mid to upper 80s. We cool things back down to the 70s and then the weekend's looking fantastic as well. It's not going to be super sticky humid and only a small chance of some showers on Sunday morning. So it's going to be fantastic. Not like this previous weekend. Yeah, for sure. Oh, that'll be nice to have a beautiful weekend. Yes. Thanks, Brittany. Still